Fox 35 News continues to investigate the wheel at Icon Park. Remember this? Sparks flying. Dozens of people trapped 400 feet up in the air. More than five weeks later, that wheel is finally back open for riders. Well, here's a live look at that attraction tonight. You can see the lights are back on and it's glowing bright. The park says everything is good to go. Well, Fox 35's Connor Hansen is still digging into what exactly caused the ride to shut down in the first place. The wheel is lit up and it's spinning once again. You can see it here behind me. Icon Park says it's fixed and ready to go, but it hasn't said exactly what caused the ride to lose power on New Year's Eve. After seeing the video of sparks flying and people getting rescued, people we spoke to have mixed feelings about getting back on. On New Year's Eve, sparks flew from the massive wheel after the park says it lost power. Video from Orange County Fire Rescue shows firefighters climbing the attraction to rescue more than 60 riders. We turned to our right and we saw sparks, um, and then the power went out, uh, which was just extremely frightening. Corey Magnata was waiting in line about to get on the wheel. We asked if she'd give it another chance. No, they actually did eventually refund our money. Uh, they did offer us that we could, you know, keep our tickets and and go back on another time and nope we, we took the refund <laughs> we won't be going on anytime soon others are ready to ride regardless yeah i'd ride it as long as i know that everything's changed on it and it's safe yeah and watched a couple rotations yeah i'd ride it fox 35 has been pushing for answers for weeks asking icon park and the florida department of agriculture and consumer services what went wrong now that the ride is open, the owners of Icon Park say the ride's components were inspected, affected parts replaced and upgraded, and the ride has also passed all of its inspections. But we still don't know what caused the emergency to begin with. Why did the ride lose power? And what caused the shower of sparks above one of the gondolas? We requested a copy of the inspection report from the state to get more answers. Fox 35 has also been requesting an interview with the State Department in charge of inspecting attractions, as well as someone with Icon Park. Late this afternoon, we requested a copy of the inspection report. We've also been requesting interviews with both Icon Park and the state agency responsible for those inspections. On iDrive, Connor Hansen, Fox 35 News.